someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, Polk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. Beans and eggs, Polk. All of life is beans and eggs. So what's the end for these particular means? Freedom! True freedom! No more suits! No more Rhino! Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Yes, Jarvis, that is exactly what I would have done. <laughs> ah, like an old married couple, you two! <laughs> Control yourself! Removed. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. Guardian has no prison. He fights for profit. Untrue. I'd rip Spider-Man's face off for free.
How did you get this way, Mac? Some kind of childhood trauma? Yeah, Daddy wouldn't buy me a pony. Ain't that just the way? like a banana a horrifying endlessly uh. screaming banana wonderful image thanks <laughs> <laughs> scorpions down now's my chance <laughs> <laughs> what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed! I failed? Yes, you, freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. All units, officers are pinned down by snipers. Reported location is near Douglas. I realize Norman Osborne claims he was stepping back from running Oscorp when he was elected. But has he? Or is he using his office, his public trust, to enrich himself beyond imagining? And with threats like Electro, the Devil's Breath Sickness, and who knows what else? have never this is stable control need a report on the situation in spanish harlem observation post established no sign of priority sleep target. it off we're going in we need a medic Sort of 
flattered that Sable set up a million rooftop posts just to hunt for little old me. So much easier if Sable worked with me instead of trying to kill me. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. You can't treat us like animals. If I get sick, I'll sue you into Left the ground. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on. Let's go talk to security. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but... Hello. Your way out of here. I know a few Sable agents who would love okay. to meet you. <sighs> Bo 
multi-million dollar building with network speeds from 1995. Ridiculous. I like this thing. Control, grid's clear. Repeat, grid's clear. Gotta turn him around. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out. And the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? Wonder where it leads. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. The fabulous Osborne boys. Norman bids his son farewell. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Looks like a boatload of electrical is routed right behind that painting of Norman. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Combat prototype from the schematic.
doors are locked till the system check finishes. Schematic for the prototype mask. Norman seems to be pushing Oscorp towards defense work. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. be back any minute. Need to find that keypad. Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in Bello, peace in war. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed.
Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board, and he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready. And I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage? What the hell is he trying to create? Norman Osborne, GR-27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer. 
genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. A child's x-ray. But it's not Harry or Emily. Who is this? That aura around him. Is this Martin Lee? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. Norman Osborne, GR-27 research log. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know... Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Kinda makes sense, though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Commercial buildings. Bravo, bra- And this must be the C team. Good ol' Alpha team. Devil's Breath lab- Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in. Dr. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. Nice. Got some overlap with Dr. Michaels' path. Nope. That's just a Sable patrol. Nice. Got some overlap. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp. Good ol' Alpha Team. None of these patrols cross Doc. No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti serum. Nope. That's just to say. No. I need Ben Adder as a dead end. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath Team. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michaels. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Nope. That's just to Sable Patrol. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR 27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that? I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. Baby, don't worry. Don't worry. Mom's 
这个会治好你，放心。我我我发生什么事？我走，给妈妈呼吸。他他他！我我我。They created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Continuing to clear that balcony. You're amazing. <laughs> 
It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. Uh, no, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. Get that anti serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon, I promise. <laughs> 